Hello YouTube, this is Buddy Fox and let's play Red to the Lich King Classic. Inscription is a new profession added in Red to the Lich King Classic and we have a lot to talk about it. Let's start with Inscription Trainers. You can find trainer for this profession in every capital city, both for Alliance and the Horde. My location is in Orgrimmar. Later you can find the Master Trainer in Hellfire. Traumar and Honor Hold, and then later you can find a trainer in uh, Boran Tundra and Howling Fjord. Uh, there is also a neutral trainer in Dauran. Why do we need inscription? The most important part of the inscription is to make glyphs. You can open this uh, glyph tab when you press N on your uh, keyboard by default. Now First glyph will be added at level 15, uh, major and minor. Then at level 20 you are getting one more major glyph. At level 50 you are getting second minor glyph. At level 70 you are getting third minor glyph. And as you can see, last major glyph we are getting at level 80. After we find your trainer, let's learn our profession. Apprentice scribe. But first I need to abandon my previous profession. Let's abandon herbalism. And now let's pick up inscription. After we do that then find inscription supplies vendor and buy this inking set. This needs to be in your bags all the time if you want to okay there's a herbalism bag if you want to use your inscription skill. Be good. And this is uh, the most important, milling. Now we can talk about uh, pigments. Uh, there are six types of uh, common pigments and five uncommon types for the Azeroth herbs. From Earthroot, Beast Boom and Silver Reef you are getting Alabaster pigment. And uh, from that you can make uh, either Ivory Ink or Moon Glow Ink. Then we have the next common and the first uncommon pigment. Uncommon pigment is the green pigment. Next group of herb is Briahorn, Mage Royal, Bruiseweed, Strangle Kelp and Swift Thistle. We can get the Dusky Pigment and with that make my, uh, Midnight Ink and the uh, Verdant Pigment ok I got it and with that we are making Hunter's Ink uh, then we have the third group of herbs uh, which is King's Blood, Grey Moss, White Fruit and uh, Vowed Seal Bowl. from this uh, type uh, we can get Golden Pigment to make Lion's Ink and burnt pigment uncommon to make don't star ink then you have the fourth group uh, fade leaf goldor cadgar whisker winter's bite uh, from this group we can get emerald pigment to make jade fire ink and indigo pigment to make royal ink first one is common the second one is uncommon white and green Then you have the next group of herbs, and that is uh, blind weed, uh, grom's blood, uh, purple lotus, arta's tears, sungrass, and firebone. Looks like I have uh, all of those. Uh, from this group, we can get uh, violet pigment to make celestial ink and ruby pigment to make fire ink. And then we have the last group of Azeroth herbs. Uh, that is uh, Mountain Sewer Sage, Plague Boom, uh, Golden Sansom, uh, Dreamfall, Ice Cap. From these, we are getting Silvery Pigment to make Shimmering Ink and Sapphire Pigment to make Ink of the Sky. Let's start with Ivory Ink. Uh, let's go with Create Soul. 
let's make it until 20 and then talk with the inscription trainer and see what we can learn I still can't turn the next uh, ink so let's uh, create scrolls whatever you want we have agility strength into experience stamina uh, let's buy some white parchment let's go with 20 and create 20 scrolls At 35 we can uh, now learn Moon Going, so we need to create 15 scrolls from 20 to 35, not 20. And we can learn the first Armor Vellum, and there are three levels of Armor Vellum, 1, 2 and 3, for both weapon and armor, you can make these, and then uh, sell it or give it to the enchanter, and then he can enchant the uh, Armor Vellum with uh, Armor Enchants or Weapon Vellum with weapon and chance and use it in your outs or sell it at the auction house uh, let's make moon going as many as you can uh, you're going to be needing moon going later for minor research uh, let's get a few more points we can either go with armor vellum or scroll of recall and we can learn during main scribe at 50 inscription Uh, one more white parchment that should be enough for 75 Good to meet you. Relax. and the uh, minor inscription research let's go with that uh, we need white parchment oh. again and this is probably daily cooldown 20 hours yeah 20 hours uh, new item glyph of way on hands bye bye now. oh we have a new ink nice dusky pigment now let's make midnight ink create all 1 minute 14 as you can see it's green after 77 uh, let's train all the glyphs we can then at 85 and 90 we can earn additional glyphs uh, with pie white parchment and make whatever you want at skill 100 we can learn the next ink called lion's ink also earn all the glyphs you can Let's go with create two. Next goal is to reach 125. Let's earn more glyphs. Now make whatever is orange or yellow to reach 125. Now we need, need common parchment. How you doing, man? At 125 we can learn Expert Scribe Then we can learn new ink called Dawn Star Ink uh, Let's learn more glyphs We can also learn Strange Tarot and Tongue of the Dawn Let's create Dawn Star Ink all we have Dawn Star Ink is only used to create Strange Tarot And two more items so You don't need it to create glyphs so use it uh, for leveling right now it's orange uh, let's level something else first and then uh, make more glyphs and uh, then use the strange turret Relax. around 145 check out how many strange tarot you can create let's go with create five then i can sell the rest of lion ink oh don't start ink
Now we can learn the next thing, Jade Firing and more Glyphs. Jade Fire Ink is great at 155 and until 175 uh, let's make Glyphs, then we can learn the Royal Ink. As usual, make the orange or yellow what you need. 175 royal ink and more glyphs. Celestial ink at 200. So let's go with the royal ink, create all, and then create more glyphs until 200. At skill 200, we can now learn Celestial Ink. Two more glyphs. Now let's go create all this new ink. After that, I'll be creating glyphs until 225. Go for orange glyphs. At 225, we can learn the new ink. We have a new ink. Fire ink. We have new glyphs. Let's make all we can, and then we can continue with orange glyphs. Inscription 245. Now I don't have any orange glyphs. We can learn weapon vellum 2 and make that, or go with the yellow glyphs. I will be creating 5 of these uh, weapon Vellum 2 to get to 250. I need to buy more heavy parchment. At 250 we can learn how to make shimmering ink and 2 new glyphs. Earth Shield and Monsoon. Uh, let's go with Create 2. I think around 40 should be enough. Let's see. After that I will continue with the uh, orange glyphs. Looks like at 255 we don't have orange glyphs. We can learn scroll of spirit or we can go with yellow glyphs of your choosing. Let's go with 5. And uh, let's see, uh, we have new glyphs now. Yeah, we can continue with orange glyphs now. At skill 275, ink of the sky and new glyphs. Nice, this one is orange, let's go with create all. I have 15. I get if I can get 15 points that would be great okay we have uh, more glyphs and looks like I got the 290 at rowing, uh, that's uh, from the herbs, nether pigment, outland herbs. Nice, we can move to outland now. I'm in tower in Traumar. If you are playing as the ones, then you need to go to the honor hold and find the master inscription trainer. What can I do for you? Master scribe. Now let's make uh, Etrao Ink. Etrao Ink you are getting from herbs in Outland. I think there are 8 types of herbs. You have Nether Pigment uh, and you have the Ebon Pigment. Let's go with Etrao Ink, create all, and then uh, we will create uh, more glyphs. Etrao Ink is grey at 305 as usual. Now let's go with more glyphs. 
let's continue with glyphs until 325 we have created a new ink at 325 but I don't know if you're going to need it at 325 you can make dark flame ink but I don't see any good options uh, to use that ink so my recommendation would be try selling ebon pigment or you can check out the prices on your auction house uh, what is higher value ebon pigment or dark flame ink I would recommend continuing with glyphs until 350 At 350 you can't turn any more glyphs from your trainer You can either continue making glyphs if you want or need them Or you can go to Northrend and uh, learn to make ink of the sea Ink of the sea will be the ink in Northrend Thank you for watching this video, remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more World of Warcraft uploads and streams. If you would like to support my channel, you can use that stream elements paypal link in description of this video. Until next time, goodbye.